Hey guys, today we're going to talk about Megan Markle's sister, Samantha Markle. This is because an ongoing case in a Florida court, case or complaint brought on by Samantha Markle against her sister, Megan Markle, because the Duchess of Sussex said that she was raised as a non-only kid. As a non-only kid because she's the only child on her mom's daughter's side and she is the youngest of three on her father's side, knowing that the first two children are 15 to 16 years older than her. So there was an audience on the 8th of November. She attended. Megan Markle sent her lawyers. The presence of the claimant and the defendant wasn't required, but Samantha made sure to be present and also made sure to appear outside the court in front of the photograph. Well, I've already spoken about this case. I've said that it wasn't a valid case because Megan Markle was just giving her opinion, whereas Samantha thinks that she was stating a fact that had, according to her, slandered her or her name. So she posed for the photograph outside the court and she said something quite interesting, right? Something that is the opposite of something that she had said during interviews on the Hatefield anti Meghan Markle channels. Basically, she said that she never said she raised Meghan Markle. She said that her and her brother only contributed from when she was 0 to 12 years old. By contributing, she meant changing her diaper, taking her to school, going to the park with her, and that it lasted until she was 12. She said that during that time, the people who really took care of her throughout her life were Doria Ragland and her husband, Thomas Markle. This is what she said in front of the journalist. So in this case, she admitted that Doria was there to raise Megan, whereas when she was interviewed on one of the Hatefield channel, she didn't make that clear. She said that she didn't know where Doria was and that she certainly wasn't there and that it was her father who was raising Megan, always asking where Doria Ragland was. But then in front of the journalist, in front of the court, she said otherwise. She said both Doria and Thomas had raised Megan. I think that she knows that if the case goes to court, the defense lawyer of Megan Markle would be pressing on that, asking her why she lied, right? That's why she's rectifying everything now to say that she never stated, right? She never slandered her sister's name or her mother's name, Doria's name. That's why she's changing things now to say that Doria was present when Megan was growing up. Anywho, I thought it was good to mention that to say to all the haters and trolls who think that Doria wasn't there, they were lied to if they listened to what was said at the time by uh, Samantha Markle. Anywho, also, Samantha said that she lived next door to Megan and that she had a great relationship with Megan. The problem is, Samantha Markle was fighting for custody for her children with her husband. And at the time, she was saying on the papers to be the resident of a different state. And we're talking about when Megan was less than 12 years old. There's like a 60, 17 years difference between Megan and her, which means that when Megan was born, she was already 17 years old. When Megan Markle was four, she was 20 something. And at the time she wasn't living with Megan Markle, having, I think, eloped allegedly with her boyfriend because she was pregnant and she lived in a different state. So how come she was living in California and in a different state with her newly formed family at the same time? So she's hoping that it goes to trial not because she wants to win, just because she wants Meghan Markle to appear and so that they would start fishing for information regarding her life in the royal family. Anyhow, in any case, let's pray that this case doesn't go through because it's just a waste of time. To be honest, people have the right to say that they felt they were raised like an only child, which is what Meghan Markle said. Meghan Markle said, I was raised like an only child. She never said I was an only child. Apparently, Samantha Markle doesn't know the difference or doesn't understand it or maybe she doesn't want to understand it so just a waste of time so let me know what you think if you like the video feel free to click on like if it's the case subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to be notified when i post a new video thank you